All right, so today's project is a 2001 uh, CBR 600 F4. F4i. F4i. Um, Tell me the story behind this guy. So, <laughs> this guy <laughs> thought he was, uh, he was gonna make it away from the cops. He tried to run. He had a blackout switch kind of deal up on, up somewhere around the like hand controls, the dash area. And he um, turned off all the lights and he was running from, apparently by the time this all went down, uh, multiple cops. So he had a steady behind him and sounds like he pretty much went to slow down to avoid another cop and the Sadie bumped him in the rear end and uh, made him lose control and dump the bike and then the bike ran into the cop car <laughs> that was ahead of him. So. And this was your uh, Craigslist find of the week. Yes sir. Mind uh, me asking what you got it for? 290 beans. Awesome. <laughs> with, a, with a salvage title. So. Yeah. Okay. Better. Not bad. We're pretty confident that it'll run. It, it definitely, it wanted to start at one point, but uh, we gotta get the fuel pump to prime. And yeah. There's obviously some wiring things going on. Some and very hacked up wiring. We'll have to search into that and figure out what's happening. There we go. First thing we're gonna do is uh, use Mikey's homemade hoist here to uh, lift it out of the truck. I wanna see this thing in action. All right, we got the truck backed in. We have pushed the hoist over the bed. And we're unstrapping the bike. Okay, we've got the uh, bike all chained up here. We're about sitting uh, right above center of the tank. Got straps on the back. And uh, we're going to give this a shot. <laughs> Let's see it go. <laughs> it's fun because we don't know what we're doing. <laughs> we're up, we're up. There we go. Now I'm gonna do a burnout out of my garage. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna do that. We're good. Good. Plenty of room on your uh, passenger side. There you go. And there she is. I just want this to hang here. This <laughs> yeah. shit, like every time somebody comes over, I'll just lift up the garage door and be like, dude, check it out. I got the coolest, most useless garage in the world. Uh oh. So, what's the, uh, tell, tell us what the plan is for these parts. It's 50-50 right now. I mean, there's, there actually is a decent amount of parts that somebody might want for, for their bike. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, the engine was really the only thing that I was after, engine and harness. And if I come to find that we can uh, do something real cool with it, we'll probably end up putting it in a buggy or doing, like I said, just something cool with it. I don't know yet. Yeah. I always wanted to get a hold of one of these and then out of the blue this happened, so I'm just kinda kinda winging it for now. Kinda like we do everything. <laughs> Let's see what happens. 